you can argue this is the most influential martial artist of all time, the great Bruce Lee, making his walk to the octagon here tonight, Jim. Everybody wants to be Bruce Lee. They say they want to be like Mike. If you're a fighter, you want it to be like Bruce Lee. You want it to be that fast. You want it to be that charismatic. You want it to have an ability to just freeze your opponents. Your speed, your movement, just the diversity in the attacks that you can give your opponents would just confuse people. I mean, I watched him beat a seven-foot Kareem at Jabbar to stay undefeated. Right. If you can do that, you can do anything. I fear not the man who has practiced 10,000 kicks once, but I fear the man who has practiced one kick 10,000 times, Bruce Lee in a match. Just so wise. Bruce Lee enters the octagon with his mind set on one thing tonight, that UFC champion. Ready to fight? Ready. Good. Well, what a visual this is. Bruce Lee ready to go for round one, the founding father of modern mixed martial arts. It's hard to simulate his speed and his striking in training, and I think that's something that has been a big focus for the opponent coming in here tonight. Quick with his hands, quick with his feet, and obviously a guy who gets off to a very good start more often than not. Bruce Lee ready to go for round one. Punches in bunches as he lands another combination there. Really doing a nice job stringing his shots together. He's doing a great job of stringing the shots together and also just mixing up the target and the attacks. Great job finding different places for his strikes to land. Oh, misses with the jab. Beautiful kick. Well, the right hand has been there at times, not that time. Keep your hands up for me now. And that one certainly found the target. Oh, nice. Nice. Big liver kick lands under the elbow. Well, the one thing about throwing jabs is that when you throw a jab, you kind of set your, your, your lead leg because you're trying to extend on the jab. If a person has good timing on leg kicks, they will land almost every time. So you got to be careful. Beautiful shot lands to the leg there. Nicely timed kick to the body for the champion. Just over three minutes now to go in round one. Oh, beautiful straight right hand. Well, now these kicks are really starting to pile up since he found his range. This could be trouble. Oh, big punch land. Circle to your right and keep that right hand up. Just misses there with the left. All right, single collar tie now. Oh, just out of range with that punch attempt. Oh, how about the accuracy to land right there? His opponent's wobble champ. He's hurt bad. He cannot take another shot like that. Nice shot there by the champ. Oh, such a natural jab, and there it is again as he gets the hand right to the target. I mean, right to the target, John. It's like the dude sitting there with a red target on his nose, just getting beat up, hit bullseye after bullseye after bullseye. I love his ability to faint once and then throw that jab right behind it. It's nasty. Good punch. Back and forth we go. Oh, Superman punch. 90 seconds now to go in the round. Well, he misses with the left punch there. Well, champ, I don't see that well, but it's hard to miss the redness underneath that elbow. A lot of bodily investment from his opponent tonight. Yeah, it's an investment, John. It may not pay dividends right now, but the more you go there, the more damage you do eventually, it will show itself. Right now, it's starting to show. Back 
Back to the leg kick now. That one's no good. Able to connect with a beautiful jab. Man, DC, his hands look good. A lot of volume, a lot of accuracy tonight. He's doing a great job being accurate, but he's also very fast. Look at the hand speed. Right. Well, he has really come out aggressively to start this fight. He's staying technical, but we have certainly seen an uptick in the volume and the output compared to his previous fight. Good start for him here tonight. Right here, you gotta empty the gas tank, John. You gotta just go forward and let everything fly. Jab gets the attention of his opponent. He gets to the single collar tie. Look for him to wear on his opponent by pulling the head down and punching with the free hand. Clean punch. Final seconds of round one. All right, so the kicks to the body, certainly the big storyline in that previous round. DC, take us through the replay. He did a fantastic job of finding his spots. He was sneaking that kick right up under the elbow and landing those nasty body kicks. He did a great job of recognizing a weakness in his opponent's game and really taking advantage of it. You ready to fight? Ready. Go All right, ahead. let's get to round two. All right, so the next round is underway. Will it be more of the same? And by that, I mean all of those strikes to the body. You've got to think at some point the opposition is going to lower that guard or get finished. And that's exactly what he is hoping for. All those great body shots, all that damage he's putting on his opponent will force an opening up top where he will look to finish. Guess the single collar tie now. Miss with that jab attempt there. Well, he continues to land a high number of strikes here, just like he did in the previous round. This is a world-class display of striking here tonight. Well, missed on that one. Lee's right torso starting to bruise pretty good here. And he's looking for that left hand, just missed. Oh, there's the swing and there's the miss by Lee. Nice body kick. Trying to do damage now with the kick. That's a miss. Oh, nice. All right, so he continues to land a high volume of strikes. He talked to us a lot about pace and pressure, and he has certainly kept up his end of the bar. I mean, the cardio is fantastic tonight. He is pushing at a level that we have not seen him fight before. This is shades of Kobe Covington, Max Holloway, those guys that can fight all night. He is showing you that he has done the work in the training room, and it's on full display tonight. Champ, look at that redness underneath his elbow. A lot of those strikes to the body starting to pile up. Getting beat up and being smart enough to not be headhunting the entire time. I like this. I like this approach. Under three minutes now to go in round two. Well, he's really starting to land a high number of strikes here in the second round. No denying that he has taken the message from his corner and picked up the pace here in round two. Swing and a miss with that straight left hand. Oh. Well, at this point, he's got to be way up on the judges' scorecards, clearly winning the fight. and. Largely has gotten it done with his striking time. He got it done with his strike. He fought well behind the jab, but it was a significant strike that really did make an impact on the judge's mind. Oh, that one landed, yep. He's got a good left hand, there it is. Oh, he just continues to pour it on. He has been aggressive all night long with his striking. Got to be careful here to not empty the gas tank. So far, so good, though, in this round. Looking to land the leg kick now. Lee's got a bruise now starting to appear on the right side of his body. Watch for that 
Oh, good work with the jab there. 90 seconds now to go in round two. Oh, nice takedown defense. Well, he's had next to no answers for the body shots here tonight, and now some redness really starting to develop on that side. We're starting to see the damage. We're starting to visibly see the effect that all these body strikes are taking on this guy. He's got to do something different, and he's got to be very careful because look for his opponent to go over the top now that he set him up. Under a minute to go. Nice body kick right under the elbow. Starting to do some really significant damage to the body here. Another strike lands there. All right, so the redness is omnipresent now. He has absorbed a whole lot of body strikes. Pretty good poker face, but I'm not sure how many more of these he wants to take. No, he doesn't. He needs to do something different. He cannot continue to get beat up like this. But it's on his opponent. It's on the guy that is landing. Oh, picture perfect shot there, DC. And one more of those, he might be out. I mean, the fight is going to be over. I can't believe he's still standing. That shot landed perfect. Ooh, found a home for that knee. Push kick there to the body. Final seconds here of round two. Oh. Ten minutes oh. in the books. All right, take a seat. Great round, bud, man. All right, now we take a look back at some of the highlights. He has had his kicking game going early and often tonight. I mean, on point, right? He knew that this was going to be a way for him to take control of this fight. He's used those kicks to really put him out ahead. And I'm not sure if his opponent has the ability to adjust and stop him from landing these over and over. Ready. Ready. Go. Here we go, third round of this championship fight. All right, next round is underway. You know these are two of the more conditioned fighters on the roster, so cardio is not going to be an issue here. And for some fighters, you know, you can have one of those adrenaline dumps or the cardio abandons you on fight night. Not the case for these two guys. Both look very fresh as we start this next round. Throwing that jab, no good. Well, just as he did in the previous round, continuing to land a high number of strikes here, and he hasn't really showed any signs of slowing down. Scary, scary proposition for the opponent. Get your rage back. Get out of there. Let's go. Move those feet. Controlling the fight behind that jab. Man, he has been masterful on the feet this evening, and really his weapon of choice has been that jab. He has had it in his opponent's face all night long. Oh, looking to land the leg kick, but unable to find the target. Big reaction as he absorbs yet another body shot, and you see the referee maybe start to close the distance a little bit. This could be a TKO in short order. I mean, John, we love violence. I mean, that's why we love our job so much. We get to watch people hurt each other, but it's hard to watch this. Yeah. This guy is as tough as they come, but these body shots have really accumulated, and he is starting to take way too much damage. Able to land the left hand there. Well, let's take a look at the numbers. He is landing at a very high percentage here tonight. Oh, he has landed a high volume of strikes in this round and really hasn't let up when it comes to his aggressiveness. The striking has been on point every step of the way. Careful to not gas out, but you got to like the output here down the stretch. Big power shot there. Oh, well-timed with that team. There's another one. He's throwing these punches in combination, really dictating the face to his opponent. Nice punch to the head. Doubled up on the jab there. Nicely done by Lee. Back kick there. Tried to set up the straight left, but he missed. All right, so a good series of kicks by him there. He has mixed it up beautifully, I think, on the feet tonight. He is kicking everywhere tonight. He's doing a fantastic job. 
Well, you know this is the Hurt Business, and both guys have a huge connection by him there. He needs to get on his bicycle, John. He needs to get into space so that he doesn't get finished. With two minutes and change to go in round three. Superman punch lands. These boys are standing right in front of each other, just kind of going at it. Again, going back to the jab, just out of range. All right, there it is, another strike targeting that damaged area on the body. Is this a game plan thing, or perhaps trying to set something up high later? On? Well, I think it's, I think it's all, it all works together. You get the hands to start to drop, and then when those hands drop, you go over the top with that head kick. But beating up the body sets up the attacks up top, and that is exactly what this guy is doing. Another nice kick there. Solid series of kicks. They're all landing now. Big shot to the head. Well, we wondered earlier why there weren't as many body strikes. He's making up for lost time here. Shot to the body connects, and that bear's watching. That's going to hurt this opponent. And that's, that's the danger in the engagement there. Oh, perfect execution on the low kick. All right, so he finally gets the takedown here. He kept on trying, stayed committed. He told us before the fight, at some point, I'm going to be able to take him down, and that's exactly the way it played out. Nice transition. Oh, high-level stuff here with the ground and pound by Lee. This is where he wants to be. Posture's up. Oh, and he lands a brutal strike to the head. Another ground and pound strike lands. Well, any time you are in a ground fighting situation with this fighter, you're potentially playing with fire. That guillotine is tight. Ten seconds to go in the round. Now stops inside that closed guard, DC. Full guard. Let's see how patient he is as he attacks a submission of big ground and pound. All right, three rounds down, potentially stop, stop, two stop. more to go. We are headed to the championship rounds. All right, take a seat. Deep breaths, breathe for me. All right. Now, I need you to refocus, and we're going to take this fight in a different direction. I want you to start looking. All right, let's take a look back at some of the replays from that last round. Unbelievable to see these high-level competitors get in each other's face, tuck their chin, bite down on the mouth guard, and just let it all hang out over the course of five minutes. You ready to fight? Ready. Go. All right, here's round four. Fight scheduled for five five-minute rounds. Strike lands. Big strike lands. Now he looks to try to chase down that fist. Big head kick. He tries to take out the leg. Beautiful leg kick lands. Trying to go to the body here. Unable to find the target. Can't take many of those. You better check. He does everything so well. And he's so calm. He's so calm in the face of such a big spot. Back and forth we go. Nice job by him defensively there. Straight right hand, no good. You rip the body there. Gets to the single collar tie. Look for him to drive and move his opponent to find openings to land that free hand. Came with inches right Damn there, you. boy. Wow. It was a good night if that landed. Look at that leg. Let's go. Keep pushing forward. Throws the team. Oh, hard work pays off. Lands the Superman punch flush. Fighter lands a jab. 
Well, he is at his kickboxing best tonight. Another nice, good series of kicks by him there. I mean, the kicks are coming in bunches. Normally, it's the hands. Tonight, he's throwing kick after kick after kick. Clean execution on that leg kick. There it is. Right back on his legs. Under three minutes to go in round four. Hands high, hands high. Beautiful technique on the straight right hand. Huge knee lands in the post. Trying to hammer that lead leg. Oh, effective strike there by Lee. Cardio looks great. He's still bouncing. He's still moving. He's still real confident. He's trying to set a trap here before he can engage and really spring in there with a couple big strikes. Bleeding now. Nasty cut on his nose. Just out of range with that right hand. Oh, nice. Come on, let's get it. Two minutes now to go. Oh, and there's that inside leg kick. And just slap yourself hard on the inside of your leg and tell me how that feels. I mean, it really hurt. That's the soft right. part of your leg. So you land that over and over again. Guy will have a very tough time maneuvering out of a lot of the techniques you throw at. Well, it didn't take him long to get a good read on his opponent. Another good series of kicks there. He thought the kicks would be the key tonight, and they sure have been. Oh! Single leg takedown. Right inside his opponent's guard here, DC. You don't want to play around here too long. No, you got to either have two hands in or two hands out, or guys start to attack triangle. Postures up and lands a brutal strike to the head. All right, so inside the open guard of his opponent, you got to be careful playing around for too long here on the ground with this guy. Oh, so an interesting decision there as he decides to stand up and relinquish the dominant position. Strike landed pretty cleanly there. Push kick there to the body. Nice uppercut. Well, he has stayed busy and he has stayed accurate. Nice combination. Very accurate, a lot of activity, and the hands look phenomenal tonight. Real nice body kick lands. Back to the jab now. Leg kicks all day. His mobility is compromised. Might get it back a little bit as the fight continues, but that's an obvious limp right now. Well, it's going to take ice on the calf, ice on the thigh when he gets to the corner to try and bring it back. But once you get dead leg, there's not much you can do. Oh. And there's the buzzer oh. indicating the oh. end of oh. round four. Oh. All right, so there's the end of the round. Big story in this one now. The cut on the bridge of that nose from that strike. The cut man is in there. Should be able to shut this one and potentially prevent it from being a factor here moving forward. All right, I'm being told we've got some replays from the previous round, and it appears as though the cut on the bridge of the nose is getting worse by the minute. It's getting worse by the minute, and he's got an opponent in front of him that wants to target it. He wants to hit him on the nose over and over again. I wonder if every time he gets hit there, the blood goes down into the mouth, making it difficult to breathe. You ready to fight? Ready. So here it is, folks, fifth and final round. All right, next round is now underway. DC, any major takeaways after the previous five minutes? That both of these guys are very evenly matched. The matchmakers did a fantastic job when they put these two in the octagon. So even though it wasn't crazy, you got to see high-level mixed martial arts. Big body kick. That one snuck in. Nice strike. Tremendous head kick lands for this guy. Oh, big head kick land. Nice block. Punch went nowhere. 
All right, seems as though his sole focus is attacking that. Oh! Hurt He's mixing up his target. He's throwing kicks, he's throwing punches. Just out of range with the big right hand. Throwing that jab yet again out of range. He's got that jab working, nicely done. Looks as though that kick to the body got through. Lee gets caught by that frustrate punch. Nice job by the offense there. Lands a solid kick. All right, now touches him with that left hand. Man, it's almost like he's got a range finder out there. Just too easy as he connects with another good series of punches. There. If you're boxing this guy and only boxing him, you will be in trouble. He's got to either go southpaw or he has to actually just try to throw the whole kitchen sink at him. So I'm going to hit you and then you hit me. Back and forth we go. This is one of the best fights I've called all year. Yeah, one of the best fights. And it, it the, the blood, the injuries only add to the entry. It only adds to who's going to continue down the path and get the hand raised. Both of these guys are so tough, they really have laid it on the line. Both fighters exchange in the pocket here. Get those combinations going. Move those hands. Oh, the leg kick lands. I'm spamming leg kicks if I'm playing huh. the game. Just missed with the left there. Back to the overhand. He looks like Pac-Man. He's taking so many strikes to the head. Stuffs that takedown attempt without issue. Oh, and he lands yet another flush knee. That's going to leave a mark. And again, when you're using this length as effectively as he is here tonight, you might get a finish here in the not-too-distant future. Oh, nice. Changes his stance. You'll see a lot of this from this fighter. 90 seconds to go in the fight. Low kick is there. The right hand just misses. Well, I'm not sure if that is crimson or purple, whatever the shade. Another bruising calf kick lands flush. I can't believe he came in here this unprepared to address this attack, and now he's paying for it. Big shots being landed on both sides here. Stand and cheer, ladies and gentlemen. What a fight. Oh, nice body shot. Oh, that's a nice strike. Nice kick. These guys are going at it. And there's a nice elbow from the clinch. Oh! Just misses with the left hook. Oh, big elbow. Thirty seconds now to go in the fight. The Ladies official and decision is in. It resides with rounds, Bruce Buffett. We go to the judges' scorecards for a decision. All three judges score the contest 50 45. For the winner by unanimous decision, and still the undisputed UFC heavyweight champion of the world, Bruce the Dragon. Mixed martial arts royalty, folks. Bruce Lee, lighten up your living room tonight and giving this capacity crowd a whole lot to cheer about.